Hello, hello, and welcome once again, J76NY here, and we are back in the Solomon Sea on our Operation Watchtower playthrough on Killerfish Games, War on the Sea. And now we did encounter a Congo-class battleship in the last episode. We took care of that with our uh, torpedo bombers. Uh, Surface Action Group 5 did not have to engage them. Um, plans for Surface Action Group 5, they are taking up a forward position in the uh, Solomon Sea, and they are going to be heading up to bombard the airfield that's been causing uh, quite a bit of problems for us. Unfortunately, that means they are going to be in the crosshairs of the Japanese pilots. So sit back, relax, and enjoy this episode of our American campaign. I wish the Enterprise could launch. Uh, all right, we're not going to do that. All right, so the afternoon scouting patrols are going up. Tar Heel Strike Group, I have a feeling they're going to come under uh, attack from those torpedo bombers. Really wish the Enterprise could launch. It's bugging me, bugging me something fierce. How long it is before we uh, run into those destroyers? That didn't take long, and then that's a little more than destroyers. Oh no, it's not. Okay. Surface action group five. Let's take them out. Turn 
Turn off auto gunnery, turn on radar. Uh, who do we have in the area for scouts? Kingfisher, where are you? Way down there. All right. Have you... Climb up. Maybe a little too far out to uh, see him. We'll adjust when we uh, discover the the battle group or the four destroyers head off in this direction. All right, speed things up. See if we can. Uh, Come across anything juicy? Give it a little bit before I pull them out. They may just have been too far away to, uh, to see, so we're going to pull out and uh, continue on our course to intercept. Enterprise ready to launch aircraft. That's very good. Okay, 12 Wildcats. Gonna have you patrol above Tar Heel. Okay. Then moved out a little bit, and then gonna have the other 12 patrol right above uh, Enterprise. So we've got some combat air patrol here. Uh, while we're at it, we're going to launch uh, We're going to launch Avengers with rockets up towards that destroyer group. And there they are. So we will try again. All right. Oh, shit. <laughs> All right. Okay, break everybody. Going to turn them. Okay, get our anti-aircraft fire up. Hopefully we can do some damage here. See if we can figure out who they're moving in on. It's like the little rock may be the target of this one. Yep, so we're gonna spin her to the right. Turn to starboard. I don't want to lose the Little Rock. I already lost the Sullivans. And she may not be the target after all, so... 
set her back to where she was. Northampton. Yeah. Yeah, it looks like uh, Northampton's the target here. Softly hit by bombs. Alright, we've got more coming in. Northampton hit by bombs. Spinning to the right. We'll rock you as well, just in case. Well, they are coming in. Northampton may be in trouble. Yeah, she got hit pretty bad there. Still haven't found those destroyers. Okay, slow down. Have everyone come to a stop so we can fix our damages. how bad we're hurt. Softly got hit too, so uh, she should be able to repair just fine. This is in Northampton I'm worried about. All these fires. Let's get them under control. Still have yet to see the destroyers, so... Have our Kingfisher do some scouting while we fix the damages. Moderate damage. Uh, nothing's blacked out except for the two that already were, so we should uh, should be okay. As long as the fires don't spread. Okay, let's speed up time a little bit. Could use another group of uh, Avengers for, or not Avengers, but uh, Wildcats for a third combat air patrol, but gotta make do with what you have. Mm. Alright, here we go. Alright, softly we're going to identify 15,000 yards out. Have you pick up to 20 knots. Savannah, 20 knots. Little Rock. I'm going to have you go flank and come north. All right, have you come out like this, Lang? Have you go 11 knots for now, and then I'm going to bring you up north. Right, let's get the uh, let's get the identification going. Okay. 
Okay, Fabuki. Sashio. We'll go with a Kagero for you. And Minikaze. All right, let's assign some targets. Savannah. Actually, let's get softly targeting. Fabuki, Savannah, or get this Kagero. Little Rock, you're gonna target the Kagero as well. Northampton, target the Asashio. Once you get your damages repaired, you can uh, join the fight. Lang, Minikaze. Okay, Northampton, how you doing as far as damages go? You still got a fire to contend with. Uh, I guess we can start moving you slowly. Ten knots. And have you nav out here. Okay, we are going to go armor... High explosive, narrow spot. Begin firing. Savannah. Begin firing. Pensacola. See, I was going to use these guys as a shore, for a shore bombardment, but we've got a uh, threat that's in the area. I guess we could switch to uh, armor piercing. Do some manual fire with you. On the Asashio. Uh, it's going 26 knots. Closing the distance. That's... Around, first rounds here. Let two salvos from our forward guns go and then hold fire. Not bad. adjust your course a little bit so you can fire your rear turrets as well. Okay, Northampton, are you firing yet? Not yet. How's your damage situation? All fires are under control. Bump your speed up. Lang. Alright, we're going to have you stay out here. Little Rock is yet to fire. 
Open fire. Have you adjust course as well? Like this. Okay, Pensacola, back to you. Okay, Asashio. 25 knots, 12,000 yards. Let's put you right about there. Two salvos. She's already taken damage. All right, hold fire. It's a little bit ahead. Second salvo is going to fall behind her or not. All right, she's losing speed. Uh, down to 18 knots, 16 knots. Put you right here. Two salvos, she's down to 13 knots. And we do have a one of our ships taking fire, so we're going to have to deal with that after these salvos go out. Okay, hold fire. Secondaries. Open up. Okay, we've got this destroyer on fire. Let's take a look at our... Uh, who's on fire here. Uh, anyone? Northampton, maybe? Not sure who that was. Let's take a look through the binoculars to see what we can see. Okay. Lang and Northampton are about to collide. Okay, Pensacola, we're going to open up with your main guns. Softly, Little Rock, Savannah, Northampton, and Lang. Okay, Lang, you can come in and bump your speed up. I think I'm going to switch uh, Savannah's fire to the... To that lead Fabuki there. Let's get our solution up a little bit. Who's targeting the Minikaze? Anybody? Lang is. Alright. Open up with your secondaries. Okay, you can bump your speed up as well, softly. Right now we have to be mindful of torpedoes, so... Looks like the uh, Kagero and the Asashio are running. Let's check them out. On fire, smoking, looking okay, could be worse. 
Doesn't look like they've launched torpedoes yet, but they're definitely moving into position to do so. There we go. Okay, Pensacola. Savannah. Northampton. I think Northampton's holding fire here. We're going to let her take some shots. Okay, Pensacola. I want you to turn slightly. Looks like they're maneuvering to launch their torpedoes. And they still have them. Fubuki, Fubuki's on fire. There we go, one down. All right, softly retarget the Minikaze, Savannah, Minikaze, Lang, Pensacola. Open fire. Open fire with your secondaries. Uh, primaries. Let's see what we have here. All right, so we're going to let one salvo out with her and hold fire. Okay, open fire with your primaries as well. Let's get them reloaded. Oh, she's not even moving. Yasashio's not even moving. Okay, well, manual fire. Okay, never mind. Don't manual fire. Okay, Little Rock. Softly, Savannah, Pensacola. Pensacola, you target the Kagero. He's going 21 knots. Savannah, Northampton, target the Kagero. Lang. This Minikaze could cause some problems. Not for long, though. Okay. Here we go. Softly. Fire. Savannah. Garo. Fire. Northampton. Uh, fire. And Pensacola. Fire with your secondaries and then manual with your primaries. Alright, 21 knots, 23 knots. She's picking up speed. Um... Let's turn you slightly so you can get all your guns to bear. You should be able to do it. 
slow you down a little bit too. 17 knots. Manual fire. Okay, 21 knots. Put it right about... Right about there. For sale. Problem with targeting everybody like this is uh don't know which shots are yours, so we're gonna hold fire for now. See how we do with that first uh salvo. Looks like it fell a little bit behind her, so Okay, Kagero. I think our ships are certain to find the range. Let's see what we got. 23 knots, 15,000 yards. I think I probably overshot off him. The, uh, yeah, that's a hell of an overshot. I'm going to fall over here. Very old fire. Whoops. Now oh, she's turning now. Down to 17 knots. Okay, let's... And she's straightened out. So we will go right here, see how we do. Let's make sure nobody's running into each other. Okay, hold your fire. This next salvo right here. They can get there. It's not looking too bad. I think that might have been a hit, or maybe it was her firing. All right, next salvo. Let's see, put right there. Hold fire. That was a little far behind, so we'll compensate, bring it out a little more. Right there. Just a little bit behind. Okay, 
Okay, hold your fire. See how that one did and then check on our ships. We're basically running broadside to her. Okay, got some hits there. Down to 16 knots, 14 knots. She's dropping in speed, so we will put the next salvo. Right there. Okay, that was a waste of a salvo, but whatever. And that's the battle. Last Japanese destroyer in the Congo battle group going down. Okay, so let's check it out, see how we did. Actually, let's check our damages first, make sure we don't have a... Uh, oh, here we go. Alright, we got a little bit on the soft later repair. Have everyone come to a stop. Okay, get those damages repaired, shouldn't take too long. And there we go. 14 command points gained, 4 destroyers sunk. Alright, it's 4 o'clock, so let's get them up there. Six hours. <laughs> They're just not going to leave us alone. And torpedo bombers. Fantastic. Pretty sure Enterprise can't launch yet. Nope. Okay, everybody break. Flank speed. Once we see where they are, uh... Coming from, we'll, uh... Or coming for, who they're coming for, we'll adjust. There they are, right there. Alright, the first wave of... I believe these are zeros. Nope. Break. 
gonna turn you away. Break. Have everybody take evasive action. Looks like they may actually be <coughs> may actually be moving in on softly. Oh, maybe not. Any luck? We screwed them up enough that they're uh, not going to be able to get any hits on us. All right, softly, steady up, playing, steady up. Flew right over us. Alright, Savannah. Steady up. Little rock as well. Okay. Make your turn. Fish are in the water. Oh, that's not looking good. Alright, let's pause for a second here. And have everybody turn. Nope, that's not what I want. Oh, we'll take it as they come. Savannah's in trouble. Oh, just missed, just missed. Little Rock. Steady up. Northampton. Head out here. Pensacola. Head out here. Looks like Northampton might be moving right into the path of them, so have her turn around. Actually, not too bad. We'll just have her run. And we got more coming in on the Lang, looks like. Oh shit. Oh shit. Full stern. <laughs> ah, there we go. Causing more damage than the enemy is. Well, that sucks. It's like Lane just dodged the torpedoes. Northampton. Pensacola, you guys figure it out. Softly's off doing whatever. Okay, let's check our damages, our self inflicted wounds. Minor damages, minor damages. Could have been a lot worse. Alright, you guys can stop. You don't need to. Reverse out of the collision anymore. It's like everybody is uh, out of harm's way, with the exception of uh, Savannah and Little Rock. Okay, let's get the damages repaired. While we're at it, everyone else can just come to a stop as well. Before we have any more collisions like this.
Okay. Only imagine what's going on between the crews of these two ships here. Alright, all damages are repaired, so we can leave. Not quite yet, apparently. Or why that is. That'd suck if there was a sub here and I didn't know it. I have to say those torpedoes are a little easier to dodge than the bombs. All right, and that's going to call episode number 83 to a close. Uh, we are heading up with Surface Action Group 5 to Under the Cover of Darkness, deal with that airfield that's been giving us so many problems. Uh, Tar Heel Strike Group has successfully moved out of range of the uh, Japanese planes, so I think they're safe for now. Uh, as you can see, I'm setting course for, I think it's Buka, and we will just completely obliterate that airfield, just because. Such a pain in the ass. Anyway, if you like the episode, hit that like button. If you are new here, like what you see and would like to follow along, I'd like to have you. Hit the subscribe button and you can come along with us through the rest of the American campaign. And leave your thoughts, tips, and advice in the comments below. Now keep in mind I do stream this on the weekend, so you may see a couple episodes go by before your advice gets implemented. But I do uh, try to follow the guidance of my trusty comment section advisors. J76NY saying thank you very much for watching and have yourself a very good day.